We are very happy to be here in Malmö, where we hope and intend to settle for years to come. Malmö is the perfect place for Nordic panorama, as the city and region is a melting pot of multicultural activities and the natural home for interesting, edgy and outstanding shorts and talks, which embrace the unique voices of the North. For me, uh, filmmaking is about having enough time and uh, be patient enough that life unfolds in front of your camera. And I think that is what happens here. But of course, everything is in the editing. Yeah. If uh, someone else had had this material, the film would be another film. I, I totally agree. I mean, you get really invested in people's life. And, and the camera is in many ways like, a, you, you enter in almost like a therapist. Yeah. I guess it happened to you many times that people tell you something that they haven't told their, their loved ones. Yeah, the camera is like a catalyst. Yeah. yeah. And with the Metallica film, um, you know, Metallica some kind of monster, uh, the camera literally was capturing therapy. And uh, has anyone seen the Metallica film? Okay. Um, cheers. Cheers. <laughs> and Lars Ulrich is from Copenhagen, right across the way there, uh, the drummer for Metallica. Uh, that was the last time I was in this part of the world, was filming Lars and Cop running, jogging in Copenhagen. Um, but actually, in that film where we were filming psychotherapy sessions of these heavy metal rock stars, Lars said that the camera was like a truth serum, that if the cameras weren't there, uh, they probably, the band would have broken up, the therapy wouldn't have worked, and they were using the cameras to say things to each other that they hadn't said ever, that, that, that needed to be said. Which of course raises the interesting philosophical uh, question, you know, are, are we observers or do we change the things we come to observe? You know, and I think both both can happen, but I, don't, I think that any filmmaker who says he's just an observer doesn't change the outcome. I think they're, not, they're kidding themselves. There is a Danish poet, he's called Henry Holt. I just want to give you one of his poems. Uh, what are we doing as filmmakers? He wrote, I pick one stone and let it fall against grey soil, I've changed the world. I walk in the snow and my footprints stays behind. I've changed the world. Because I touch you, you move your gaze seven millimeters in my direction. I've changed the world. And I really believe that art, film, films, books, that they can Sometimes change the law. Sometimes they can remind us, remind us about the humanity that we really need to protect in the future. They can, for some, for example, Hussein and Hassan, um, in my opinion, change their lives because they met me and now they are allowed to stay in Norway. And if not, they would in some part of Afghanistan, even though the parents and younger siblings has been killed in the front of the youngest brother, Hussein. Um, I really believe that, so please keep on doing your work. Thank you. How se manipula the system of society in Cuba if it doesn't work, francamente, with a woman?